What's going on people? It's Josh and Chris from The Soul Supplier and we need you to set an argument. Is Chris a giant man child? Basically, I spend bare money on collectibles and shit and now Josh doesn't rate me for it. So I bought in some of my collection. I'm gonna show Josh and see his reactions to some of this stuff. He's actually lost bare G points from the time <laughs> I met him to today. He's on like minus 100 G points. So you've already seen this one. We was playing with it in the office yesterday. A Supreme Wiffle Bat. Basically, it's a bat and a ball. This thing flies a ball up for you, innit? I have no explanation of why I caught this. It was just preen. So, it's pretty dope though, let's be honest. How much you pay for this, fam? It's like 40 quid, innit? 40 pound? Bro, don't make out you only joined it in the office yesterday, though. You paid 40 pound for this? It's got, it's got world famous on, innit? Um, it's a bit of plastic. You can go pound now. Nah, you can go pound like real tall. You can go pound land, yeah? And you can cop something with, it might not say Supreme on it, but it'll say something similar. We've got 40 pound. Yeah. Right, I'm gonna add this to the calculator. Talk me through this. This is the Palace Frisbee. Yeah. How many times have you used this? I only got it the other day and you picked it up. And how much you pay for this? 15 pound. 15 pound. It's hanging on my wall when I get my room decorated with all the bat. You better hope you find a girl exactly <laughs> like you, bruv. Imagine like you ever moved out of a girl. You haven't seen the toys yet, bruv. So now, we have Boba Fett take off his helmet. Baby Milo, are you dumb? Bathing ape, Star Wars. Are you dumb? Bro, I've loved Star Wars from day in it, so it's calm. How much do you pay for this, bro? I don't actually know, it's a what present. So I'm saying, I think it sells about 150. What, what does it do, bro? If I said to my girl, hey babes, I bought this toy. Like, I copped the toy, and she goes, how much? One fifth. Mmm, yeah, nah, my girl probably leave me bro, huh? she'd leave. That's she it. She doesn't truly really love you then. So you've seen these in the office already. The supreme meditation balls. When you meditate, they jingle in your hand and shit. These are 42 pounds, the, the tag's still in there. I'm not even gonna try and justify them. Like, yeah, I know that's a bit fucking weird. What possession? All right, okay, right, that's 42 pounds. Just add it on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even trying. Austin, have, have you read any of these? Just about to say, that's why I bought them in. We've got the Quarz Higher Beast, the Kif Limited Edition Higher Snob. When this come out, it come out with a Puma as well. The Puma was bummed, but I only bought it because of the packaging. It's fucking sick. All right. And then we've got the Colette Limited Edition Higher Beast as well. I think I've flicked through this. Yeah. It's pretty dope. Bro, if you scratch this one off, yeah, it's like half Germany, half that's American flag. Fun, who buys magazines not to read them? Because when I get my room done. <laughs> like, so imagine my room's gonna be like this, yeah? So we're gonna have like mm. magazines here, we're gonna have some like toys here, gonna be dotted about, my bed's gonna be here, it's gonna mm. look sick. Are you planning to stay at home forever? In front of a minute. Like, that's it, that's it. simple. Right. How much is this all together? 45 pound. So here we have the Pharrell Quartz Aftershave. Don't even like the smell of it. Go. Bro, look at the bottle though. Is this perfume? Huh? Is this for girls and boys? Apparently, yeah. There's no such thing as a unisex fragrance. It just looks pretty dope, once again. Sick. Oh, this guy is pissing me off. <laughs> so you know when you're on the beach and you need to fully stun on people? Bang, bang. Supreme astronaut towel. No, I'm just a old high beast. Uh, when's the last time you went to the beach? Have you used oh, this? Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, of course I have, bro. How much you made with this? A 60 quid. I can look at that fog as well, that was pain. You pay 60 pounds for this beauty style. Yeah, but if you're laying in it, who's even gonna see so, that? Once again, so Greenwich Park, Wiffle Bat, Beach, Barcelona, chilling. I'm pasty as fuck, so I might as well make something look good, innit? Got a little pudding belly going on, but they look at the camera. <laughs> right, he knows what he's talking about. If you're laying on this, who's seen it? No one's seen the Super Eagle. I don't actually lay on my towel on it. Fam! <laughs> nah! Man said, so what else can I piss you off with? Like, he knows. Palace matches. <laughs> Imagine chilling in your bedroom, you light your little incense, but obviously you can't be using any bait regular match, you need to use a palace match, bro. It doesn't even look like you've used any of them. No, no, I haven't, it's because I haven't got any incense in my room. What, have Supreme not dropped incense yet? No, they have, but... Oh, you missed that one, yeah? Yeah. Oh, well, it's a bit of shame. Alright, don't rub it in, bro. Supreme Crowbar. What do you even plan to use this for? It just looks pretty dope, doesn't it? Where would it look dope? What are you going to do with this in life? Supreme egg timer. Don't even eat eggs. Go. Supreme Mophie phone charger. I actually use this. This is fucking handy. <laughs> Bathing egg bear brick. A foot patrol key. Uncut because I didn't actually want to cut it because it looked cool. Uncut. Right, if we're going to go for the old my height, we might as well. Of 
Cause companion. Not one. Two. Bang bang. <laughs> this. Oh, that was like 40, 50 quid. But a normal one of them is like 30 quid, so it's only a tenner extra for the right, last you rate. Got you got 2k max. £10. Yeah, it lasts about two weeks, though, bro. Nah. How much, sorry? Can you put it on your keys as well? No, that's what I thought. Everything you have shown me here has come to you £960. That's calm. My room's gonna look best, way. But you're never gonna get laid again. Are you prepared for that? Huh? Are you prepared to never get right. laid again? Come on, toy. You remind me of the dudes from Big Bang Theory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, shout out Sheldon. All right, so if you're watching this right now, no, you shout out Adrian Ho. Real talk now. She likes all this shit. Like that would be my hype, mate. All right, Adrian Ho. If you happen, if you happen to go past this video and think, who's that guy? That looks like Jesus. I never knew it's... Jesus and Rob Safe would be in a video together. <laughs> Adrian Ho. If you're watching, he's looking for a girl. Yeah. But I tell you, I don't imagine. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> so let us know what you think of Chris's collection and whether he's paid way, way, way too much and whether he's a giant man child. Hit and us up in the comments. I don't want any RS comments either because I mean, that can't I don't mind the Jesus comments, don't it's, it's yeah, Jesus, Jesus, or... Jesus wasn't even white, Jesus was black, but that's, that's not Jesus really. was a G though. Jesus, Jesus, can't. Was, Jesus was black, so anyway. But yeah, let us know what you think of Chris's collection and how much he spent on it in the comments below. And if you've got a better collection, hit us up as well. And we look forward to hearing from you. <laughs> Until then, <laughs> It's time for intervention with Chris. Peace. Peace out. <laughs>